Aaron Rodgers and Shailene Woodley have called it quits after less than two years together and a year after she confirmed their engagement. Yes, we are engaged, we are engaged. A source tells ET that the NFL MVP and actress, quote, tried to make their relationship work. But with busy careers in different industries, it was hard to see one another. Yeah, there's no wedding planning happening. It's There's no rush. The source adds that they, quote, have no animosity toward one another and plan to remain as friends. But with no clear explanation for the split, the online rumor mill is working overtime, and some fans speculate politics got in the way. Are you vaccinated and what's your stance on, on vaccinations? Yeah, I've been immunized. Aaron's controversial stance on vaccines has been a reoccurring headline for a while now. Back in August, he claimed he was, quote, immunized against COVID-19. But he didn't actually get one of the FDA-approved vaccines for the virus. Instead, Aaron claimed to undergo a, quote, alternative treatment prior to the start of training camp. And he apparently petitioned the NFL to consider that mystery treatment as equal to getting vaxxed, like everyone else on his team. This all came to light when Aaron tested positive for COVID-19 in November, forcing him to miss games. Fans were in an uproar, but at the time, Aaron claimed he had to skip the shot because he's, quote, allergic to what's in the vaccine. I believe strongly in bodily autonomy and the ability to make choices for your body, not to have to acquiesce to some woke culture or crazed, you know, group of individuals who say you have to do something. Health is not a one size fits all for everybody. And Shailene came to her then fiance's defense after one outlet reported that Aaron had broken his COVID-19 quarantine to get coffee in Los Angeles. The 30 year old took to Instagram to slam the report, writing in part quote, literally y'all need to calm the down. News outlets still grasping at straws to disparage Aaron, finding random men on the streets of LA and saying it's him. The Big Little Lies actress went on to point out that the man in the photo looked nothing like Aaron. Quote, I know Aaron's body very well. Adding this of the feet, quote, no offense to this rando dude, Aaron's are a lot bigger. Nobody knows the full story. Last February, Shailene revealed to Jimmy Fallon that she and the NFL pro were engaged not long after they started dating during the pandemic. He's, first of all, just a wonderful, incredible human being. But I never thought I'd be engaged with somebody who threw balls for a living. <laughs> like, I never thought as a little girl, I was like, yeah, when I grow up, I'm going to marry someone who who throws balls. Yeah. Um, but he's really just so good at it. Shortly after news broke of their engagement, E.T. spoke to Shailene's pal, Megan Park. The two co-starred for years on The Secret Life of the American Teenager. I'm going to go get the photos from the shower from my car. Okay, thanks, Amy. And the actress opened up about her thoughts on her friend taking her relationship with Aaron to the next level. I like Aaron a lot. I have not met him in real life yet because of COVID, but I met him over FaceTime and he's a great guy and I I'm, I'm couldn't be more thrilled for them.